What's going on, my fellow collectors? We have the PC Toys Smith in front of us. Yes, I told you this was going to be another review. This is the other review. This is a pretty good figure, I'm not going to lie. There's only one grip I have with it, obviously. I mean, obviously, every figure is not perfect. It's very, very rare to find a very perfect figure. This guy is near perfection. Very great figure. I can definitely see PC Toys taking a shot at John Wick, which, oh man, please do it. Because we need a better John Wick than that crap that we got with Mexico. So, let's jump into the articulation really fast. You're getting a T-pose. You're going to get some bunching up in the top. You know, there's a little bit of padding going on in here. It's not bad. Some people say the coat look a little big on him. It really doesn't. It's not. It's pretty good. I like it. Very, very good. Um, there's the shirt. Nicely fitted. And I do feel some soft padding in here, too. That's a little weird. Just to make him look more buff, I guess. I think it's one of those rubber, rubber type bodies. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, unfortunately, there is no um, butterfly joint. I love butterfly joints on figures. But this one. Wait. Does this one have it? What the heck is this? I can't really tell what that is. Wait. I don't know. No. I don't feel it. It's a little weird to say. It's hard to say. You get the bicep swivel. Double jointed elbows. Swivel at the wrist and a twist. These hands are probably the bad part about this whole figure. They're hard to pop on sometimes. You know, it's pretty brittle. It's scary. You know, I don't want to break it, but I would just be careful with those. Kind of, I would put, I put a pin inside the, um, the, the hands themselves so the hole could get a little bigger and then it could be easier to pop on. So yeah, that's what you got. On the legs, kick all that far, not so much, so it's okay though. Um, you get a, a swivel at the thigh, double jointed knees, the shoes are pretty articulated, I love that. Very, very nice. All the way down, all the way up. Um, there's a swivel at the ankle. That's pretty good. The splits, obviously, he won't be able to do a split, but it's really, really, um, it's kind of restricted there. But it doesn't look too bad, you know? It's, it's He's in a suit, so it works out pretty good. Now, she has a cooler part about it. Very nice tie, but this is awesome. This is how it closes. Just like that. It's magnets. These are magnets. These little buttons here, they're magnets. And then there's another two magnets in here. And they close up very nicely, very easily. I did not expect that. I was very happy with that. So he goes that far back. And he'll go that far forward. Yeah, that's pretty much all you're getting. It's not too bad, but it's okay. So yeah, that's what you're getting. The head goes up that far. that much down not so much a uh, little bit of expression not so much and obviously you'll get the twist it's that long peg so you when you pop them out you'll be able to switch it out with the pieces here the alternate head you're getting this is the grinning face head yeah that doesn't look too bad I kind of, I think it's cool, you know, for what it is. You'll, you'll, you know who it is of your Matrix fan. Um, I am now looking for the headset or the earpiece. Here's the earpiece. Very tiny. I almost couldn't even find it. And you only get one of these, which sucks because both heads have the peg on the side, the hole. See that? I don't know if you guys can see. Uh, there it is. A little hole right there. So yeah, you're, it's it's a little tough, but whatever. I, I'm not gonna risk it. I'm not gonna put it in. It sucks when you put it in. Anyways, he comes with this gun here. Now that's the problem there too. You see how that clip just fell out? I mean, that's so cool that they even included that. I didn't think it was gonna be removable, but it's removable and the bullet is painted. So it's really nice, very very nice. Attention to detail. But unfortunately, this clip keeps falling out. Look at that. <sighs> that is scary. I don't want to mess with this. So, unfortunately, I can't really use this. 
And there's a peg hole. So if you have some effects, I'm not sure if they'll fit. I'm not sure. Now I'm not. You know what? Now I'm curious. Hang on. Hang on. Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Oh, sorry guys. None of the effects that I had from the G.I. Joe's work. The hole's too small. So, not gonna work. But, you can easily fit the hand. I mean, sorry, the gun in the hand here. Well, not really that easy. The fingers are all over the place. But, you get the point. Alright? Looks cool. I like it. Not, not bad at all. It's really cool. And he'll come with, um... Interchangeable hands, as you guys can see right there. It's exactly three, four, six pairs. You get six pairs of hands. That's it. That's all you're getting. And the sunglasses, which they are removable. Okay. Woohoo! You gotta move them. You just stick the little edge at the back here. They look really good on him too. They fit really nicely and snug, snug, snugly. I don't know. Whatever. Now, for the size comparison, let's get that out of the way now, since these guys are all here waiting. Size comparison-wise, he fits nicely with the 3-0 Bloodshot. So, Bloodshot, you know, not too, not too bad. That's not too bad at all. Looks pretty good, right? Yeah, I think so. I mean, he's, he's going to be very short, I'm not going to lie. He's just too damn short. And here he is with the uh, Mayfix Fireman. Also very short. So he's going to fit nicely with your Legends. You know, not the big bulky ones, but yeah, he'll fit nicely. He's Yeah, he's about an inch and a half taller than all these other guys. This is all I have right now at the moment, so. But this is what you're getting yourself into when you purchase this guy. He's going to run you about 100 bucks. If you're lucky, maybe you could get him cheaper. I wouldn't wait on it. I wouldn't sleep on it. I'd get them right away because these guys tend to jump in price very, very fast. He's a great character. Cool looking dude. I would recommend picking him up. He is awesome. That's my verdict, y'all. Hope you enjoyed it. Peace.